Imagine a future where charging your electric car takes less time than grabbing a coffee, a world where power grids run seamlessly on renewable energy and flights across continents are powered entirely by electricity. Sounds like science fiction? What if I told you this future might already be here? In the race to revolutionize energy storage, some of the biggest players in the world, Tesla, Toyota, QuantumScape, have been battling for dominance, pouring billions into advanced solid state battery research. But while the spotlight shone brightly on them, another giant quietly worked in the shadows. And now their announcement has sent shockwaves through the industry. Enter KTL, the world's largest battery maker. Their latest creation isn't just an improvement, it's a quantum leap. They call it the condensed battery, and it promises to reshape everything we know about energy. How did they crack the code no one else could? And what does this mean for the future of technology? Stick with us. This could be the most transformative story of the decade. The global battery industry is like a high stakes chessboard where every move determines the future of energy. With the electric vehicle EV market booming, the stakes couldn't be higher. The EV battery market alone is projected to grow to $135 billion by 2027 with a staggering 25% annual growth rate. Dominating this space has become a battle for technological supremacy. Tesla is chasing solid state batteries that could achieve 400 watt hours per kilogram energy density. Toyota claims to be closing in on 500 watt hours per kilogram with its innovations. And QuantumScape, backed by billions in funding, promises solid state batteries will revolutionize EVs. In this crowded race, all eyes were on these solid state pioneers. Yet despite the hype, these technologies have been plagued by challenges, high costs, manufacturing difficulties, and doubts about safety. But CATL, holding 36.7% of the global battery market share, decided to bet on something else entirely, a risk that is now paying off in ways no one anticipated. To understand this breakthrough, we need to dive into the fundamentals of battery technology. Think of a battery as a tiny city with three essential districts, the anode, the cathode, and the electrolyte. This anode is where electrons flow out during discharge. The cathode is where they flow in. And the electrolyte facilitates the movement of lithium ions between the two. Most conventional lithium ion batteries use a liquid electrolyte, which allows ions to move freely but also poses safety risks like thermal runaway and fires. Solid state batteries sought to address this by replacing the liquid electrolyte with a solid one, promising safety and higher energy densities. But here's the twist. CATL didn't just improve on this design. They reimagined the entire structure of the battery. The key to their breakthrough lies in two components, the 3D honeycomb anode, and the biomimetic electrolyte interface. The 3D honeycomb anode is a marvel of engineering resembling a beehive where each hexagonal cell provides a home for lithium ions. This structure dramatically increases the anode's surface area, allowing lithium ions to move in and out more quickly. But it doesn't stop there. The honeycomb design also creates space for the anode to expand during charging, reducing stress and aging at the atomic level. These tiny channels, just 20 nanometers wide, form a lithium ion superhighway, effectively doubling the specific capacity of the anode to an astonishing 400 milliamp hours per gram. Let's move on to the biomimetic electrolyte interface inspired by nature. Traditional batteries form a thin protective layer at the interface between the anode and the electrolyte. But this layer isn't strong enough for lithium metal anodes, which are highly reactive. KTL's biomimetic interface solves this problem with self-assembling artificial structures that mimic biological cells creating a uniform and mechanically robust barrier. This innovation not only enhances conductivity, but also prevents the growth of dendrites, tiny branch-like structures that can cause short circuits and fires. 
KTL's condensed battery also tackles the cathode, the final piece of the puzzle. While details are scarce, it's clear they've optimized the cathode's energy density to complement the breakthroughs in the anode and electrolyte. Traditional cathodes achieve energy densities of around 250 watt hours per kilogram, but CATL's ultra high density cathodes push this to 350 watt hours per kilogram, a 40% increase. This synergy between components means electric vehicles equipped with CATL's battery could travel 620 miles on a single charge and recharge in mere minutes. But the implications go far beyond EVS. Imagine renewable energy storage systems capable of efficiently storing solar and wind power for consistent delivery, even when the sun isn't shining or the wind isn't blowing. Remote communities that rely on diesel generators could switch to renewables, storing excess energy for later use and dramatically reducing both costs and carbon emissions. Even the aviation industry could be revolutionized. High energy density and safety make these batteries ideal for electric planes, enabling longer flights and reducing reliance on fossil fuels. Of course, scaling such groundbreaking technology to mass production presents challenges. Manufacturing these condensed batteries requires overcoming significant engineering and cost hurdles, optimizing charging speeds, cycle longevity, and real-world performance stability are key areas KATL is focused on improving. For example, their advanced materials and designs enable charging rates of up to 5C compared to the 1C of traditional lithium ion batteries, allowing vehicles to recharge in a fraction of the time. Uh, longevity is another critical factor. Traditional lithium ion batteries degrade significantly after about 1000 cycles. SWATL's new materials and structures extend this lifespan to 5000 cycles, a 500% improvement. This means batteries last longer, reducing replacement costs and enhancing sustainability. Performance stability under extreme conditions is equally impressive. Most lithium ion batteries struggle outside a narrow temperature range, but SAATL's innovations allow operation from minus 40 degrees Celsius to 60 degrees Celsius, ensuring reliability in diverse environments from desert heat to Arctic cold. Lastly, there's the question of cost. Solid state batteries and by extension condensed batteries are currently more expensive to produce than conventional lithium ion alternatives. However, KTL's investment in advanced manufacturing technologies and economies of scale is driving costs down. They aim to reduce production costs to $80 per kilowatt hour undercutting traditional lithium ion batteries and making the technology competitive. The journey to commercializing this technology is far from over, but KTL's progress is a testament to human ingenuity and the relentless pursuit of a better future. By initiating small series production by 2027 and collaborating with partners worldwide, CATL is paving the way for next generation batteries to become a commercial reality. As we stand on the cusp of a new era in energy storage, CATL's breakthrough offers a glimpse into a world where clean, efficient, and sustainable energy is within reach. Electric vehicles with performance on par with gasoline powered cars, or renewable energy grids capable of meeting global demand, and electric aviation transforming the skies are no longer distant dreams, but tangible possibilities. The future shines electric uh, with SATL leading the charge toward a bold and sustainable tomorrow. And as we watch this technological revolution unfold, let's remember we're not just witnesses to history, we're active participants in shaping the future of energy.